This video is for Apple developers who've been having difficulty updating their credit card on file when renewing their Apple Developer Program account. Now, anyone who wants to get started with developing apps for iPhone, iPad, Mac, Apple TV, Apple Vision Pro, or Apple Watch can do so with just an Apple ID for free. However, if you want to be able to distribute or sell apps on the App Store, you'll need to join the Apple Developer Program for $99 a year. So you can take a look on this website, it's developer.apple.com. If you go to their Compare Memberships page, you can see the benefits and resources for setting up a free account or joining the Apple Developer Program for $99 a year. So again, if you want to sell apps on the App Store and make money, uh, you'll need to be part of the Apple Developer Program. Now, I created my Apple Developer account many years ago, and I think I'm in some kind of stuck limbo state where my credit card information is stored in some forgotten part of Apple's backend systems. And I know this because when I went to my Apple Developer account, I saw this page here. And the error at the top says, the credit debit card associated with your Apple ID on the Apple Online Store is expired. Update your credit card to maintain membership benefits and keep your apps available on the App Store. Now, clicking on that update card button took me to the Apple ID manage page. I could then click on a link for payments and shipping to see a list of all my credit cards on file with Apple. Yet, even after updating the one card that I thought was expired with the new expiration date and verification code, I was still seeing this error atop the Apple developer account page. Now I posted on an iOS developer Slack community that I'm a part of, and I was told that it might take a few days for the credit card information to propagate through all of Apple systems and for the Apple developer account page to update. Unfortunately, a week has passed and that alert is still showing up there. And that raised alarm bells for me in my head. So I did a little bit more of sleuthing and digging on the internet. And I found this thread from 2019, so almost five years ago, which described a similar problem. And the workaround involved going to this URL, https colon slash slash www.apple.com slash shop slash browse slash account slash home. And on this page, this is like a, an older version of the Apple Store. On this page, there's an account settings section and we can see the payment method is an Apple card and it had the wrong expiration date, 7-2024. So when I clicked edit, I was able to update the credit card information uh, with the new expiration date. And then when I went back to my Apple developer account page, this happened instantly, that warning disappeared. So I'm confident now that the that my developer account will be renewed without incident later this week, and that all my apps on the App Store won't suddenly disappear. So everything is resolved for now, perhaps until the year of the next credit card expiration date, which I think is in 2029. So if you're an Apple developer and you've seen this warning, try to update your credit card information on that alternate Apple Store website if the normal route of doing it through the manage Apple ID method does not work. I hope this developer tip helps. If it does, leave a comment down below and be sure to like this video. And if you're not subscribed already to my channel, please do so. I talk all about uh, development and my apps and other things that you might find interesting. Hope this helps and we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.